Oh, girl. Strong word there. This is a scary monster. Ask an answer. What are you doing? <gasps> oh! Welcome back, gay schools, and everyone in between to our YouTube channel, The, the Horror Bandwagon. Hi, my name is Sergio. And my name is Cody. And we are boys for horror analysis. Criticism. And spooky. Okay. And sometimes kooky entertainment. And welcome back to another Buffy the Vampire Slayer reaction. Today we are covering season four, episodes 13 and 14. Now, last week we had banger of episodes. Mm -hmm. It's starting to get really, really good in season four. I mean, overall, I'm enjoying season four. Yeah. But like right now, like the main thing that we just found out was that the professor, Professor Walsh, entered a room which had like a project inside of it or something like that. I am very interested to see what's behind those doors. So I think I said, let's get into it, right? Yeah, I cannot wait. I, I'm like really excited, but there's also a part of me that's still a little nervous because Buffy and Riley seem to be working out and I just want that to last. Especially with like Wash, Wash, doesn't seem to like Buffy. So yeah. we'll see how that goes. Walsh doesn't like Buffy because Walsh wants to be able to control Buffy. Oof. She's making the classic like watcher mistake. Yes, that part. Now, before we get started, y'all know what to do. Make sure that you like this video, subscribe to our channel, and click that notification bell so you get notified every time we post a new video. And if you want to support the channel even more, you can go over to our Patreon at patreon.com slash the hard bandwagon, where you will find full length watch alongs of every episode of Buffy that we've covered so far. And if you just can't wait for next week's episode, we're a week ahead on Patreon, so go check it out. Or you can click the join button below to join our YouTube membership. And with all that being said, without further ado, let's get to slaying. Send to me the heart I desire. Oh my God. You know, magic at oh. the poker <laughs> table qualifies as cheating. That wasn't magic, I was praying. <laughs> that wasn't magic, I was praying. They're called chips, they represent money. Since none of us has any money to represent money, but that's gonna change once my merchandise hits the street. We need to get jobs, guys. Local distributor for Boost Bars. The natural food bar that provides a nutritional energy boost. The last time we had anything with bars, Chaos ensued. The fatty goodness. Come on, somebody bet already. I've got three K cards. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, Anya. Uh... Am I the only one with a big floating question mark over his head about this initiative thing? Well, they do seem to fall in the good guy camp. Seemed to be. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, Wait. is this like a practice thing? Oh, it must be a training, because what the hell did we jump on? I see. Well, still very impressive. Don't tell me you're training without Giles now. Not that you have to train with Giles, but still. See, you're a hit. Everybody loves you. Not everybody. Uh, uh, Watch is like, nope. <laughs> Later, he told me that she couldn't stop talking about this move I made where I used one of the commandos as a shield to block a taser blast. It was like 12,000 volts. Not the taser blast. You do remember about tonight, right? Bronze, the gang, are you kidding? I wouldn't be anywhere else. I miss you guys. Yeah, let's hang out with friends. That's his lunch? Oh, he is so gonna be punished. Oh Everyone's no. Everyone's getting spanked but me. Oh. What? <laughs> You went through it too, Willow. Yeah. Like, remember when like she was just flaunting their love in front of Buffy too? Yeah. <laughs> Willow is either the only taken person in the friend group or the only single one. <laughs> yeah, wipe your feet when you enter a person's home. <laughs> Be respectful, Giles. Needs a woman's touch. Uh. Care to have a crack at it? <laughs> <laughs> Spike is killing it. Mm -hmm. You owe me more than that, mate. Oh damn! Um, Three hundred. Uh, count it if you. <laughs> oh yeah, we but did. They, they agreed on it. They true. They did agree with it. Slayerettes. From here on, I want nothing to do with a lot of you. Not choosing to remain in Sunnydale might make that a little difficult. Uh -huh. We might accidentally stab you. Pleading for help, the second teen witch's magic goes all wonky. Or little Xander cuts a new tooth. We're through. Got it? <laughs> You're gonna miss us. 
Come on. I'm ready. Oh, God. I want to. I don't think we should be here for this conversation. Oh, we're going down, down. You said it was big. You told me, but you never said it was huge. That's, That's what, what she, she said. said. <laughs> this is unreal. So, you like our little operation? <laughs> Buffy needs to be careful. She's getting lost in the sauce here. Mm -hmm. When you're through reading those pages, you'll have to eat them. <laughs> She's joking. Don't worry. She, she lands a joke just like you do. You guys are pretty much similar. No, uh, my <laughs> jokes are funny. So I've seen on the Discovery Channel with gorillas and sharks, they, they made them all nice. You haven't seen it. Oh, uh, yeah. No, maybe I dreamt that. This is like, we need that Walking Dead. Uh, Professor Walsh will remember that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but I'm certain in time you'll pick that up. Don't pick that up. What is it? About $20,000. Oh, damn. What's in there? Research area. Very restricted for security reasons. Here is your security card. Oh, so she's like part of the team. I don't want her being part of this team. Grandma's, I think. I found it a long time ago in my attic. I, I want you to have it. Oh no, Tara. That's super special. Maybe tonight. I mean, if you're not doing something, you could come over and we could do something. It's her time with Buffy, no? Mm -hmm. It's just tonight, it, it's kind of a specific crowd. You might feel out of place. Oh, wait, no, bring her out. Maybe it's just wishful thinking, but I'm almost getting kind of love interest vibes. I, the love radiating. <laughs> <laughs> just the way they're talking to each other. I, yeah. All right, we're in the 314, right? 314. It's, it's the pie room. This is where they bake the pies. <gasps> almost time to wake up, Adam. Oh. Take your first look at the world. Oh my God. This is like a Frankenstein. Uh-huh, a Frankenstein's monster. Yeah, 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 to be specific. Take on your nice places. Buy pretty things. <laughs> Does make sense. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I support you. <laughs> Anya's the best. Just spending quality time with just us. She did say that. See, here she comes. Is it with Riley? Oh, oh no. Because Willow said to Tara, it's only like a friend thing. Uh -huh. Oh, and the whole team? The whole gang is here. The, the more, the more. We're going to go grab some drinks. Anybody want thing? Coke, please. I'm good. I'll take, I mean, at this time, I probably would have had like a, a, what's a, a sour? A whiskey sour. Us. Just the Scooby core, you know? Aww. I mean, I could have invited somebody else if I knew it was an open free for exactly so what do you mean exactly you've joined them no not exactly it, it buffy you literally went through a whole process do you really think this is a good idea don't you think you're rushing things a little i thought you liked riley we do like riley it just it seems sketchy bad info or not i just think there's certain questions you should ask before you go off and enlist mm -hmm. Oh God, and she has a pager now? <sighs> the miscommunications between Willow and Buffy continue. <laughs> We're confident of the target's approximate position as it leaves behind a distinct protein marker. Dr. Engelman? I like her in her top while everyone's in their uniform. Question. <laughs> Buffy? We have a question. Why exactly can't we damage this poke of thing's arms? Good question. Oh, you mean the camo and stuff? I thought about it, but I mean, it's going to look all private, Benjamin. <laughs> Don't worry, I've patrolled in this halter many times. <laughs> I love that she's not, like, changing her ways. Mm -hmm. Well, it wouldn't be a new watcher slash mentor if they didn't try to change Buffy at yeah. first. Irony's kind of ironic that way. Anyway, I know it's late, but I, I thought maybe, I mean... 
Let's hang out. Can we talk about this later? There's a dangerous hostel out here, and well, since I don't have your reflexes, I kind of need to focus. I get that. Yeah. I, okay. He's at a disadvantage. Got something. Target. Negative. Oh, oh no! He's doing the most innocent thing right now. And what kind of groceries does he need? Why does he need two giant, like, stacks of American cheese? Oh, fuck. Look, oh. troll. Oh, but it's a tracker. Say again, beta team, you're breaking up. Whoa, shit! There we go, there we go. Oh, oh! Oh, they're combining the adrenaline with sensuality, otherwise known as sex. Oh my god. Oh, wow. Bobby oh. just likes chess. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> oh my god. Don't don't cut it's uh, it's arms off. And we kind of already know that like Riley digs the fact that she's like this badass. Mm -hmm. <gasps> okay, that's an invasion of privacy. Wash. 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 What are you doing? Committing some first amendment violations for sure. <laughs> That was creepy. Why was she just looking at it? Please leave my home now. <laughs> it's the, uh, the gritty texture, isn't it? Xander, Xander's trying really hard. He's not a salesman. How is this our concern? Seeing that you've expressed a desire to have nothing more to do with us. Oh. Spike said that? Yeah, he did say that. That hurts. <laughs> <laughs> when you turn into that fioral demon, I helped you, didn't I? You right bastard. <laughs> yeah, it's all out. <laughs> I would love it if the three hundred dollars just keeps going back and forth between them for a like gag seasons. Hey. Oh my god. What's the matter? Oh, because she <laughs> Well the third time's the charm. Yeah. Everyone has the same sheet. I'm sorry. What did he just take? Which 314? Oh my god, was that Walsh? Can, does she have audio too? On paper, with the exception of being involved in a secret government program, I think that he makes a really good match for her. I think so too. But I feel like there's so much wrong. Like some, I feel like one little thing of like touch of reality, like outside of his discipline, it's gonna break him. Oh yeah. Riley, make me proud. Manipulation. <laughs> Classic. I know. And Finn will take it hard. That's why sooner is better. Oh! Oh, they're gonna give him bone spike arms. That's why! Oh! It's blinking. I don't care if it's playing rocking the casbah on the bloody... <laughs> <laughs> what? A what? It's like a homing beacon. And if commando guys are reading the signal, they're coming home. Oh, no. We got to break it. Sorry about bailing on you guys at the bronze. That's okay. I... Don't worry about it. I'm real worried about what this contingency scenario is. Well, yeah, it's so much has been revealed right now. You know, go after her? Uh, no, 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 it's your help I need, actually. Really? What do you want me to do? It's a small job. Magic, like... Take it out. Minimal aggression, meager defenses. They barely show up on the scanner and occasionally turn out to be raccoons. It's a setup. Do you think it's a setup, or do you think that they're just sending her on wild goose chases? Tell some stuff about all this that I'm not clear on. Well, when you get back, we can have a talk. Am I supposed to salute you? No. Uh, these are kind of questions like where you ask at the interview. <laughs> oh, oh. Did it work? The atmosphere I nice. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love it. And... Oh. 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 <gasps> It's a setup! 
This is almost as bad as the Watcher trial. No, the Watcher trial was kind of bad. They that's, took away her power. I know. That's why I'm saying it's almost as bad as that. <laughs> okay. But she immediately knows they were sent by the initiative. Yes. And guess what? Riley's not going to believe her. Oh. <gasps> What? No way. It definitely just fell off. Yeah, it must right? must be broken. <gasps> She's like, um, anybody see that I murdered her? Got it. There. Let's go. Um, go. go. <laughs> run, Sander, run. It went right past us. Whoa. Flushed. Oh. oh. Damn, not your brother. Oh! I feel bad, because like these demons, I don't know what their purpose were, but I feel like it's awful that they, they set them up to attack and be killed, essentially. What? I did everything I could to stop her. I told her to wait for a backup team. She kept insisting she didn't need any team. She Girl, you should probably make sure before you lay this on someone. Maybe I could have stopped her. It's hard not to blame myself. Oh, you're... Mr. Walsh. Your joke, your joke. If you think that's enough to kill me, you really don't know what a slayer is. Oh, Trust me when shook. I say you're going to find out. That gave me goosebumps. Riley. Damn, that's embarrassing for you. Yeah. Agent Finn, I order you to stop. He's not taking orders anymore. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. As long as the initiative is in operation, it's not safe for you here. No. It's not safe for any of us. I've worked too long. Too long. To let some little bitch threaten this project. Oh, girl. Strong words there. And when she least expects it. Ah! Oh! oh! What? What? <laughs> Wait! Wait Ooh. a goddamn minute! Alright guys, so that was our reaction to Buffy the Vampire Slayer Season 4, Episode 13, The Eye and Team. Now, what are your thoughts? I will say it once again. Play stupid games, <laughs> win stupid prizes. Yes. Uh, oh my god. I'm like so gagged at the ending to that episode. Oh my god. We like, we finally find out that Adam is some like chimera Frankenstein's What's monster. Chimera? A chimera is like a mixture of multiple like animals. Oh, okay, okay. So like oh man, this is gonna be such an interesting thing because I feel like they're like they were on one hand. Uh, up until this point, giving us a story of like they are capturing these demons and vampires and other beings. And it kind of and... seems like they're now using them. They're able to manipulate them or control them yeah. to for their own use. Yes. And now it also seems like as a side project, they were taking the best parts of all of them and putting them into this Doing like one super mega monster. monster. Yeah. Yeah. Also, kind of hot monster. I don't know. Maybe. I'll just you leave, can, you can I'll leave it. it there on the table. I'll leave it on the table just so you know. Um, but <laughs> uh, yeah, I thought this was a gag worthy episode. A lot happened. Something that I think uh, for some reason I thought would play out in a couple of episodes. But this one was just like, no, Wash is out for Buffy. Does not like that she's different and does not like that she's against the rules. She needs to take take her out because she knows how powerful she is. Mm -hmm. um, and then she does it in the same episode. And then Buffy finds out, exposes her to every fucking body. Well, mainly just Riley. I guess nobody else was hearing all the shenanigans that was happening. But like Riley now knows. So now we need to find out what Riley is going to do. And now we have to find out what's, what's the repercussions after Wash is now dead yeah um crazy episode i that really was amazing i love that willow kind of called her out on it like the whole mm -hmm. you know because you know once buffy like falls in love with something she kind of like just dives more deep into it yeah. and i'm glad that her friends are there to kind of like take her out and she was still there to kind of question things a little bit mm -hmm. and i'm glad that she was able to pick that up off the bat and kind of 
stop it in its midst. Yeah, and I was really worried that we were going to have an episode where, like, Riley was hearing one thing from Professor Walsh and one thing from Buffy and was going to have to choose. Yeah. But, like, I, I really Seems like love... like he chose. <laughs> I love that he's, like, he's standing there and right after Professor Walsh, I was like, Buffy died. I told her not to go. I really told her she I know. should wait for you. After, like, being such, like such a stone cold person then she all of a sudden starts to be very sympathetic was just red flags immediately for me but also we have this like sort of relationship going on with tara and willow yeah uh more than just more than just witches um because you could just feel that there's some energy essence there But I'm excited because I kind of want to know like what happened. Like what did Will- Willow just like returned and was like, "Oh, you were gone too." All right, guys. So you know what that means. We're gonna go ahead and move on to the next episode. And I try to use the gun, but it goes. You're saying that Maggie Walsh set you up? That's exactly what I'm saying. I was there. I saw it. <laughs> you think Riley was out knitting booties for your future offspring while Maggie was stringing you up? Ah, uh, Spike. I mean, it's a good suspicious suspicion to have. He seems like he wouldn't tell a little white lie, let alone a whole bunch of big dirty ones. That's why they call it the secret force as well. He would be good at keeping a lie. Isn't too keen on the fact that the entire Scooby gang knows that the initiative is up to no good. Oh, Which brings yeah. us back to the not safe for any of us concept. They're gonna come after us. Oh. This looks bad. Uh, interesting design, though. I like it. I want to be clear. This looks bad for Buffy. Not, like, <laughs> this does not look like good quality. Oh, you're like, wow, this is kind of garbage. <laughs> now, do you think that Riley is a good guy? I think that Riley is a good guy. Well, he just seems a little... I don't want to say clueless, but I do think that based on the, the orders that he's taken, he would not know a lot of well, what's going on. I think that he's used to just not asking questions, and he was okay with that because he thought that they were the good guys. But like now, that illusion is shattered. We need to relocate someplace we're less likely to be found. We need to come up with a plan. Where will we go? Come on down and boogie at Xander's Hideaway. Yes, come boogie. Absolutely not. I will not squat in that dank hole. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Damn. Maggie tried to kill me. It didn't work, but they're all upset anyway. <laughs> In case you weren't unaware. I actually now want Anya to just like be the one recapping episodes. Love it. <gasps> oh! That's Hostel 17. Damn. No, I'm just a friend of Xander's. <laughs> I forgot about that. I can't buy it anymore. Thanks to you, wankers. We've been looking all over. <laughs> what is this? You're hiding an HST? Why don't you just back off and let her ask the questions, Jack? Your <gasps> boss just tried to make monster food out of her. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Good job, Xander. But this isn't Professor Walsh. There must be something making her act this way. Something I mean, out- true. He doesn't know that she really set it up that way. Like a purpose? Something that might harm us all. No, that's... That's not what happens there. Riley. I would know. Look, no one is sure of anything. Oh, God. He's about to throw up. I mean, this is like cognitive dissonance, though. This this is a scary monster. Interesting that he was playing with a a toy that looked like Mm -hmm. him. What's that for? Let's keep our hands back oh, to ourselves. Oh, no. Okay, well, now, yeah, this needs to be stopped. <gasps> okay, you didn't see that when you walked in? Also, he didn't actually slip in that. There's no slip <laughs> marks. Oh, they all went to Sanders' basement. <laughs> oh, okay, Charles. Get some foot action in there. <laughs> that would never happen. 
Every time you moved, it made squeaky noises. <laughs> it was irritating. Really? Oh, my God. I'm surprised you could hear it over your Wagnerian snoring. Oh, <laughs> guys, we need to work together. After everything you've been through with Angel, you know, you really should get yourself a boring boyfriend, like Xander. <laughs> you can't have Xander. <laughs> <laughs> Office tells us that the boy was stabbed with what looks like some kind of large skewer, <gasps> and his body was then mutilated. Oh! I'm going to the crime scene to see what I can find out. You guys research the Pagar demon. I want to know where it is. I love the sushi pajamas. Me though. too. Probably would have sounded more commanding if I wasn't wearing my yummy sushi pajamas. <laughs> <laughs> also, Xander had a shirt that says, I love dirt several times. I know, times. I saw. <laughs> Professor Wells tried to have Buffy killed. What? Did Buffy tell you that? I mean, do you have any proof? I saw enough to know it's true. You saw it on the screen. Maybe Professor Walsh found out that Buffy was up to something bad. Did that ever cross your mind? Why does it bug you so much that I'm hanging with her? Because he loves you. Mm -hmm. I think that's what it is. It is. <laughs> she tried to kill Buffy. Maybe Buffy needed killing. <sighs> Sir. Maybe Buffy needed killing? That's a lot. Mm. <laughs> that's some blind faith. Damn, they let her stay there on the ground for several hours. Serious accusation. You better be ready to deal with the consequences. Bring them on! Supernatural freak is blinding you and I'm sick of it. Well, that's enough, right. enough. Right, man. Damn. This drama. Drama. Then we have to go after it. My orders from Washington are for a total lockdown until they arrive. I'm sorry. This is like such a bigger plot. Like, I hope they know how to handle it because for me, I'm like, okay, so Buffy's going to take down the government right now in this season. <laughs> I hope that's not spikes. <gasps> Spike, no. <gasps> <laughs> oh my God. Not by the legs. I'm sorry, Spike. They broke your TV. Yeah, that was not very nice of them. You need to see passions. This is the part where you throw me a bone. Maggie's dead. Oh yeah, she doesn't know that. She doesn't. What happened? That's classified. Classified. Oh my God. The Pogara. Don't start, Riley. Working and, and hanging out with you and stuff. I know that. But you want to do a spell. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I also love her room. It's like very witchy vibes. <gasps> I haven't seen him since so long. For some reason, I thought he was dead. I thought he died, but... I mean, he did get, like, really beat up at one point. At some point, right? It's Willie's place now, see? Brings in a better clientele. I got one of those deep fryers. These demons just go crazy for chicken fingers. Chicken fingers are good. Not yet, I haven't touched you. Sorry. Right. Right. Go ahead. No! I can't talk to you! <laughs> <laughs> but now I see you're not hunting demons. You're socializing with them. Again. But you're supposed to be killing these things, not buying them drinks. Oh, oh this guy's like, I'm just trying to have yeah. my drink. Or maybe you'd like to go back to the lab with me. I'm sure the coats would love to classify up whatever you are. Leave him alone, Riley. He's human. Yeah, leave him alone. Not because of what happened to Professor Walsh to see it now. Let go of me. Hold it. You. <gasps> whoa, whoa, Don't whoa, whoa. I say so. What is happening? I don't know if I'd have a corpse on my hands or one pissed off vampire. Riley. I mean, who do you believe? Oh, he's he's become unhinged. Yeah. Oh, what's happening to me? You know what I think it is? It's the vitamin. Maybe he didn't take the vitamin that he took before. Ooh. Remember how he was like, I'm, I need to drink, eat this. He's in withdrawal from whatever sort of mind control thing they had him on. <gasps> oh! 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 oh. oh. Beyond the bad guy. Maybe I'm the thing you should kill. No. Don't you even think that? I think you're just on the bad side, but you didn't know all that. Oh. Oh. 
there's just reminds me of how angel was like at a moment you know where mm -hmm. he like changed hey remember before no xander not in a boyfriend <laughs> way or a lead him to a certain death way oh she's trying to protect him can't you do something else to help them like xerox handouts or something <laughs> oh, be careful oh this is so sweet oh. it creates this mist over the parts where the demons are oh. it, it even makes different colors for different breeds oh oh well what's it gonna do since it's a whole bunch of different breeds in one i know <gasps> it's like we did it too oh with shoot, your we knowledge got... <gasps> may we go in safety tara <laughs> What? I'm the only one that can pass the retinal scan. The... Ew. I don't want to see that. <laughs> Eyes. I would actually prefer that they have it be set up so it's like, all right, everyone, welcome to the stage. Buffy Summers! <laughs> oh, and she gets a lap coat, too. Quick, pretend you have with me. What? What are you talking about? Well, I, uh... <laughs> what? This is... <laughs> this is the initiative, Sander. Military guys and scientists do not make out with each other. Well, maybe that's what's wrong with the world. <laughs> <laughs> How has he been hiding out in Sunnydale for the last two days without anyone seeing him? Exactly. <gasps> oh! Damn. Telling me she went to the initiative? Freddy, listen. Stand away from the stairs. No, you're gonna get Buffy killed. <gasps> no! Oh! Hey. Uh-uh. All right. Pretty bad shape, but we stabilized them. But Finn wasn't one of them, right? No. Find him. He's the one I care about. He's too important to the work to lose now. They've been dosing them with something. Yeah, what's that? <gasps> oh! What the fuck was that for? No, I don't generally like to kill humans. But I've learned that it pays to be flexible in life. I was wondering when you'd turn up. Oh, fuck. Roll to the stockade immediately. Riley, he can tell us what we need to know. Maggie wanted me dead, didn't she? She did. Now you know. It escaped. That's enough. You're making her sound like some psychopath. Oh, Riley, you're gonna have to face facts. Everything that we need to know is here. We just need to find out what was in 314. Oh! <gasps> Ask an answer. Me. Ah! Here we go. I want to learn about me. Why I feel. I like that they're just letting him have this monologue. He would want you to stand down. Yes. But I seem to have a design flaw. Oh. A brain? <laughs> and she didn't love you. Is that really the issue? She made you because she was a scientist. Riley. Because he's. Oh. <gasps> she fed you chemicals to make you stronger. Your mind and body. She said that you. <laughs> Wolfie's like, sorry, I'm learning a lot about you. You haven't been programmed to. I cannot be programmed. I'm a man. It's here. <laughs> I'm a man. Doctor. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Oh! Oh! Okay, Riley is down. Are you okay? Buffy, we need to go. Yeah. They're, they're going to, like, be mad at us. We take care of our own around here, understand? Oh. Buffy. We need to go. They got guns. Oh, with the Slayer. Oh, you kill other demons, and the rest of us don't hold with that. You know what? I understand. It's not like I can spend all my energy going after the initiative. Not while Adam's out there. He's really that big of a threat. Yep, for sure. Mm -hmm. I'm sure he's okay. There's no way he can be. Everything he's ever believed in has been taken away or. Yeah, and possibly blames us for it. Mm -hmm. I mean, they're probably just going to give him the medicine that they've been giving him all the time. I'm worried that they're going to try to brainwash him.
Wow. Crazy episode. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, so that was our reaction to Buffy the Vampire Slayer season four, episode 14, Goodbye, Iowa. What are your thoughts? This is a very interesting episode because I, the thing that's sticking out in my mind more than anything else is what were they doing through this medicine, the pills that they were giving them? Yeah. Like, what were they dosing them with to try to make them stronger and faster and smarter? It's, I really want to know. I just feel like at this point, it's such, this is, this is getting so big that I'm afraid that I don't know how Buffy is going to take all of this down. Because ultimately, this project alone now cancels out everything that these, if there, even if there is something good to be done here, it now needs to be shut down. Yeah. It needs to be shut down immediately. Well, and now the federal government officially definitely knows about the Slayer, who she is. And they probably wanted to, like, nix this because, I mean, that thing murdered a child. Yeah. So, like, they probably are, like, the government's trying to wipe this under the rug. And Buffy needs to just dismantle it altogether. Plus, dismantle Adam. I do like, though, that... They are really leaning into the Frankenstein's monster tropes with him. Yeah. Like how he is very smart and stitched together with a whole bunch of different things. Yeah. And articulate. And also that he like, uh, like the first, one of the first things he did when he escaped from his creator. Yeah. Was, I don't like that he killed a kid. I want to be clear. But like, <laughs> I, I, I think that it's an interesting way that they're tying it back because the way that he was describing it, it's almost like he just wanted to understand how how the boy worked. Yeah. And so he, like, tore him apart. Oh, brutal. Yeah. But, I mean, yeah, you're right. It's very interesting how that goes. I like that this season is now, like, diving into a very sci-fi element mm -hmm. aspect to it, which I really enjoy. I mean, there's a lot of sci-fi moments in this show. Also, the idea that Tara tampered with the spell yeah from for willow she seems very about willow and she seems very like friendly but that in itself that is like weird. what's going on because i mean nothing bad happened but like but it, do, like, do you think she's just like jealous like she doesn't want to make willow a better witch i don't think that that's it like the i think the charitable way of reading the situation would be that she wants to have willow like need to come back to her again oh see i didn't even read that or i, I was like evil <laughs> or a less charitable version would be that you know i could also see where she recognizes willow's inherent power and she wanted some of that for herself fair but i don't know what just having that potion on her own would do for her unless yeah. she's looking for a specific kind of demon that's fair but overall i'm still very very interested i'm wondering what spike is gonna do like this whole season has been very much like spike's journey also to see where we go i love that he's still very evil and still thinks that way but he just uh, he adjusts himself to the situation and i i love that we're taking that journey with him that he's progressing over the over the course of this season and um it's not like it doesn't feel rushed it feels like natural character progression yeah i i'm loving that spike is turning into the sassy bad guy who can't be bad oh yeah all right guys so that was our reaction to these episodes as usual make sure to comment down below let us know what your thoughts are on them as well as make sure to keep the comments spoiler free as much as you can we want to take every single bit of information that the show gives us once at a time when they give it to us during these reactions and not in the comments. But we also want to give a shout out to our patrons. Thank you so much to each and every single one of you. You have no idea how much your support and your love over there means to us. You truly, truly are the best. If you want to go over and join the Patreon gang, go over to patreon.com slash the horror bandwagon. Benefits start at $3 and up and where you'll find next week's two episodes, full reactions over there. And if you want to unlock exclusive emotes and members only lives and watch alongs, you can click the join button below to join our YouTube membership. Big thank you to those YouTube members and those who are YouTube members and Patreon members. You guys are freaking awesome. But until next time, we have been your source for horror analysis, criticism, and spooky, okay? And sometimes kooky entertainment. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye.